Hey Stampers! Welcome to another week of Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Aubrey and I'm so excited to show this project that I have for you today. I'm not stamping a card today which is really fun. I have a fun home decor item that I am going to show you how to do and it's really cute. So for this project you need a candle, just a wax candle, and you need a piece of tissue paper and a piece of wax paper and whatever stamp set you want to do and ink colors and whatever. So I'm going to use this. This is new in the holiday catalog, Be Jolly by Golly. And it's so cute, it has these fun sayings. So that's what I'm gonna use this one, the Be, Go the Be Jolly by Golly saying. This stamp set's available in the 2016 holiday catalog. You can purchase it from September 1st, 2016 to January 3rd, 2017. Okay, so I'm gonna get started. I have Real Red ink. I'm gonna stamp my saying in that. And I'm just gonna stamp it right on my tissue paper here. Just like that. And then, let's see. I'm going to get my garden green and I'm going to stamp a few trees. Like that. And some cute dots. So simple. I love this idea of maybe like a neighbor gift or something that you could give a friend for a Christmas gift. I know it's kind of crazy to be thinking Christmas right now, but it is coming up. So then you're just gonna take your, let it dry a little bit. Then you're just gonna take your tissue paper and just cut it out. And you wanna cut it fairly close to your image. And it doesn't have to be perfect or straight lines or anything. Just, you do wanna make sure you're careful because tissue paper obviously can tear and rip pretty easily. So be pretty gentle with it, just like that. Okay, and then you're gonna get your candle. So then you're just going to take your image and you're going to put it right on your candle, just like that. And you're going to take a piece of wax paper. Now you want this wax paper to go all the way around your candle. So you have to be able to grab it in the back here and hold it tight, just like that. Okay? And then you're going to take your Stampin' Up! heat tool. You can see the tissue paper melts right into the candle. So once it starts to get that waxy look, you know it's working. Okay. And then you just peel the wax paper right off. This ink, when I stamped it, it was a little too inky for what I was doing. So this is the one that I did last night. And you can see the difference. You wanna make sure your ink pad isn't quite so saturated for this project, just because the tissue paper, it bleeds a little bit more. Isn't that so neat though? It, the tissue paper just melts right into the candle and you can't even see it anymore. Just like that. Such a fun idea. So I made a few other candles here. So here's a few more Christmas ideas. We have our gingerbread men. And I just added a few more embellishments on some of them. This one's fun. It says, it's the most wonderful time of the year. And we use the pine cone set on that one. And here's one with some cute candy canes. And like you can see, we added some rhinestones to that one. Those are the Christmas ones that I did. And then I thought, I think they're so cute just for home decor ideas. So I, of course, I love the pineapple. So I did a pineapple with the Oh Happy Day. And remember my raccoon card 
I thought, how cute would that be for like an outdoorsy themed baby nursery? Just make up a, cu a couple cute animals and set them up on the shelf. I think so cute. And I used the Paisley's and Posy stamp set on this one. And this one I did kind of differently than what I showed you. On this one, I wrapped the tissue paper all the way around the candle. As you can see, it has an image all the way around. And the trick on that is that you want to just make sure that the seam at the back so this is this is where my seam would have been right here you just want to make sure you're not over stamping so you don't have half of a paisley right on the seam and on this one i use the frosted medallion stamp set and as well as adding some of those cute sequins that go with it and i also colored in with marker on the tissue paper and i i stamped over so you can customize it however you want to do you can use more than one color it is really fun and super easy to do so and then I thought it is really easy I should see if my kids could do it which as you know is always a struggle for me to let my kids get involved in my creating because I'm a, I'm a bit of a perfectionist but I let them get involved and they made these cute little ones that they're so excited to put on their shelves next to their bed so I have my my three-year-old made the bunnies and my seven-year-old did the snowflakes and my five-year-old did the hearts. So cute and easy that you could do for a fun little project with your kids as well. On their little ones, I just had this every occasion stamp set from the, the annual catalog um, and let them choose a fun image that they could stamp from that. So I wanna see your creations. If you have an idea to make for a fun candle that you could give to a friend or for a home decor idea, please share with me. I'd love to see it. And if you'd like to place an order, make sure you click in the links below. And we're going to try something new. If you will like Stampin' Jill on Facebook, share this video and tag two friends on Facebook, we will be giving away this Be Jolly by Golly stamp set to one lucky winner. By the end of this week, we will know who the lucky winner is, so share it today. Thanks so much for stamping with me today and we'll see you next week for watching.